Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Rick and ProSlidePacks back here Ed, with a question about um, how to get rid of the sketch hand between sketches when you're doing your animation because sometimes the hand can cover the animation and really the answer is the same trick that you used in 1.0 which is to put an intermediate character between your sketch items. So let's see what we can do to show you what I'm talking about. I'm put a number on here because I know I'm going to have to do more of these. So let's create sketch scene and let's add uh, the clock to begin with. Okay, we got the clock right there. We're going to add some animation. Um, let me start here. Lock this up. Make it bigger. Start in the center, I guess. Then over here, uh, in one second, it'll shrink down and then flip. Okay. Then I'm going to add another point and just bring it back over here. Flip it back and make it a little bigger just to be doing something. Okay, so that's one. So let's see what that looks like. Okay, so you don't see the hand because it's only the one item there. So now let's add another sketch item. Let's put this guy up. Okay, put him right here. And let's see what we got. So let me preview the whole scene. Clock comes up, shrinks, flips, goes around, boom. And then the hand is still there on the screen while all that's happening. That's not what we want. So uh, the, the, the old tried and true trick is to add some text in between. So I'm not gonna even change this. Now for those that don't know, using your mouse wheel, zoop. See, look at that, that is really nice. I'm gonna put this down here off the screen. This is the frame the text is in. I'm gonna put that in between these two. Then when I get out of here, I'm gonna go back to this scene. Action before will be nothing with no time either side. Now, when we preview the scene, the clock is drawn. Watch, when the clock's off the animation, see the hand is gone now. Hand's gone. Now it's back for the second drawing. So that's that's basically the you know the same trick, same old trick that we've always used. I mean I can we can swap these around and same thing will be true. Drawing that guy over there off the screen, and then the clock comes back. So, same old thing. All right. Thank you.